Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to the world of dinosaurs with me little lizard and today we have Scuba Steve Scuba Ooh, I Steve. am here. I'm finally here. You said dinos. Uh, am I in the wrong place? No, this this is dinos This is dinos. <laughs> it's okay. been a while. I know so Scuba if you yeah, you kind of know but we okay. did lose the world, the original series world, and we have started this new one. And you know what? I'm starting to fall in love with this one. Usually it takes a while, but I'm starting to enjoy it. And let me show you why. Follow me. Follow me. Ooh, okay. Show me, show me, show me what you got. Because usually if we lost the world or something, you'd be crying for days. But you're yeah. happy. I'm Do you surprised. know what? I was upset at the start, and it's taken a while to get back in, but we're, we're kind of getting going. We've got some things from the original that you may recognize, like the T-Rex skeleton oh. in the middle. Oh, oh, oh you like yes. I actually wasn't in the episode when this got finished, I don't think. Oh, you might not have been. Oh, yeah, true. So there is our big, beautiful skeleton. That's going to be like a feature piece in the middle of the pack, right? If you oh, come yes, down here, we've got a Triceratops pen. Tiny Turtle has one. You know, my history with Triceratops has not been the best. No, it hasn't. <laughs> so, um, I don't have one yet, but uh, Tiny Turtle's one just sits in the in the water the whole time. It's like having a bath. I'm not sure if you can get out. We might have to get in there and, and help it out. But anyway, down here is what I want to show you. Now, this, is the, this is the good okay. stuff over here. Where are you? Did I go the wrong way? Oh, no, uh, just down back, here, backwards. Yeah, yeah, back towards. Yeah, okay. So I saw this pen. Do you see this pen? Is there anything in there, though? Yes, there is. Yeah, yeah. So um, actually, new to everybody are the walls. I started working on the walls. So they're reinforced stone going around the mountains. I didn't want it to leave it just dirt okay. because oh. I'm not sure how safe that is. Because this is a dangerous dinosaur pen. Now, it's a is it a sheep? There, like a there is a sheep in there. There's a, like, do you know what's good? They they can spawn in there because they will be food as well. But check it out. Follow me. Look over here. Ooh, okay. Look over here. Creeping around. I'm interested. Right here. Oh, hey! Spinosaurus. Spinosaurus. Baby now. Very baby. Oh. Only just hatched. Uh, quite friendly actually at the start. Do you know what I need to do? I, I've decided I need to clear any trees out because. I don't want it like growing and getting stuck in. There was a T-Rex in here, Scuba. And what happened? I don't know. Do this is the thing. We just walked over and it, I found a lot of like meat and bones and it didn't oh, end well no for the T-Rex anyway. And it was oh. a big T-Rex. Oh, okay. I thought you meant like last night and it was a baby Spinosaurus versus a baby T-Rex. Oh, no. Like no, 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 no. Well. Because this was like a fully grown T-Rex. I don't think the Spino would have much of a shot if that was the case. But we don't know what happened. Now, that's why I'm clearing out some trees. I made the watering hole bigger. I put the feeder in. Trying to do everything we can to make sure these actually uh, have a fighting chance. But uh, yeah. we're not going to really know ever, I suppose, what happened to it. No, nothing ever will... Um... We, we definitely won't know what happened there, but this little guy you're saying is friendly He's, enough. So I far, mean, it's all good. Hasn't taken any food yet, though. But I think it's just because it's young. Yeah, okay, so you've got your food dispenser, your automatic food dispenser. It's all in there. Right there. Yeah, and we got some meat. Yeah, there is, and I haven't seen him go for it. Now, here's something I wanted to test. So I'm just going to head back up. You need to do this, actually, as well, because it's nighttime. Back okay. up to the lab. We'll sleep it off, because you can set your spawn then. Yes, nice. Because you don't Ooh, have that, zombie actually. On you. Zombie on me. Um, so yeah, we're going to sleep it off. And, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, uh, oh, actually, here you go. Boom, boom. You Some bread. Where is he? Be able to sleep. Oh, he's coming. What you doing up here? Right. <clears throat> Did you get the bread? No, I got it again. Uh, right. I think you picked it up. I'll grab it off you. Okay, so here's the thing with today's scuba. Now, you know how we started with T-Rex last time. Yes. This time, the first DNA we got... Spino. So I'm thinking, right, if we put a baby T Rex in while that dino is still a baby, and if they grow up together, they might be friendly. Okay. Oh, okay. What yeah, are you thinking? That, I mean, I think they seem very, very nice and friendly when they're young. I mean, yeah. a grown up Spinosaurus and a grown up T Rex that I've never met. Um, I think there might be trouble there. But exactly. I think if we do it when they're young, like, like puppies. Exactly, because it's like a bear and a tiger being friends. We've seen it; it can, it can happen, be done. but they <laughs> need to be they need to be raised from like pretty much from cubs and babies. So I've got a Tyrannosaurus DNA right here. I'm gonna start the process on getting us a little, uh, getting us one of these 
T-Rex eggs. So let's see okay. where we get on. I've got nucleotides. I've got the the lab set up over here. Not looking as good as our previous lab, but no, I mean, it does like the job. It, it does yeah, it the does job. The job. Everything's in order and it, it is. looks good. Now, yeah. I've almost forgot how a lot of the stuff works. Do you know what? We did as well. So I've only just organized it in order because I've been using it again. So you got to clean in the cleaning station, clean off the fossils first. Then you got to grind down the fossils. Then yes. you need to use the DNA sequencer to get it on a disc. Then you that. Com combine the two discs to get 100% in the combinator. Right here is the synthesizer. This is where you will get the, um, the DNA in a test tube from the disc or into a syringe. Then, oh no, no, that's into a test tube. And then you, right here, you put it in the syringe into the Petri dish. You get yourself, put it in the egg, put it in the egg, put it in here. Da -da 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 -da. Hatch a dragon. Ah, <laughs> no, yeah, I, I got it. I got it right the whole way. And I said hatch a dragon. Hatch no. a dragon. No, I didn't <laughs> even notice that. Oh, I remember because we used to have to look for that peat moss, which was hard to find. It's but not yeah, too bad. I found here, by the way, because oh, really? yeah, because I took the helicopter out. Do you know those big hey. roofed, um, the the big roof forests? Yeah, there's like I, I saw like a lot of the. It, it kind of looks like a oh. Jurassic -y kind of land. Is that where what it's all in? Um, no, they, that's what I'm saying. The, the root forests are another big biome that you can get it in. So it's not ah, too bad. Okay, well, once you have enough of it, that is good. Exactly. So right here, I'm on to the calcification machine, which is putting the T-Rex um, DNA into an egg right here. Boom, we've got it. Look at this already. Boom, so fast. Wow, it's so quick. Remember how long it used to take? Oh, well, I mean, mm -hmm. we were building the machines at that time too, so. Ooh. What do you okay. think? So the Spinosaurus down below is a female. Okay. Do you think it would matter what the T-Rex is? Should we be aiming for one specific or Ooh, just let it be random? I am. I think random. Let's take random? it out of our hands because we're gonna we're gonna come up with loads of different theories of why it should be this and why it should be that. Just 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 let it happen. Just let it happen. I think keep, maybe. Keep it, keep it in the middle. Okay. Ooh, I don't I know like if that's even starting up there. But yeah, that is going to be the goal today. Hatch a baby T-Rex, put it in. We've already got the feeder and everything there. Um, in terms of the other thingies that we've got. Ooh, we've got more Dryosaurus. Ooh. What? Do you know what a Dryosaurus is? A Dryosaurus? Yeah. No. I do They're not. definitely not a Wetosaurus. They're a Dryosaurus. <laughs> a Dryosaurus. <laughs> I, yeah, no, I, they've okay. got little snouty faces. Um, I think we'll be able to hatch one, and I've never seen what it is, so I'm I'm kind of intrigued to get one going here. Yeah, what you definitely. Thinking? If you if you if you have the stuffs, do it. I just need to make another storage disc. Uh, how do I make them again? Crafting. Okay, basic circuitry. Yeah, I could make one. So will I? Will I do it? I may as well. I don't yeah, know what do we'll it, need do, do. in terms of like a an area i wonder will we need something big i don't think so they, they look yes. like it's kind of small i don't like not knowing i mean what happens if we hatch a monster like a uh, big monster yeah what if he's huge i don't know that, that's a bit of a gamble oh no we need more gold i can't make any more discs tyrannosaurus brachiosaurus spinosaurus yeah i need to go we need to go mining if i want to make that i think Ooh. Mining. Okay, these things aren't that big. I just looked them up. They're not that big? They don't look that Ooh, big. Okay, well, they that's fun then. They don't look too much bigger than... I mean, maybe a raptor size? Oh, okay. We could work with that. Do you know what? Let's do an indoor area for that. I kind of want to mix oh. it up between indoor and outdoor. A Dryosaurus is a human-sized herbivorous erythropod. Okay, Ooh. so it's a, it's a human-sized thing that doesn't eat us that doesn't <laughs> so, eat us that's always good news no, no. yeah that's exactly no. all right and sweet so we can definitely do that indoors because we don't need to make it overly big oh. all right uh i need to go make some do you have any torch oh, no you you don't have anything because it's like your first day pretty much I just got a wooden pickaxe and i'm gonna go look for what do you need what i just came out of the village you're at a I, village how did i jump in there and come out of the village you're coming up as well look Come is, up is, is right here. Oh, have you ever been here? 
I don't know. It is, I'm guessing we're not that far from home, which means we probably came through here. <laughs> yeah, ah, we did, okay. yeah. The blacksmith's gone. But that's kind of crazy how we just kind of wandered in here. Okay, Alright, let's see. Do. Anybody trading go? <gasps> Three emeralds for 17 storage discs. 22 what? coal for one emerald. So if <gasps> we get coal... Okay, okay this the, is nice. There 20 is coal. coal down. How many coal 18 coal. 15 glass. He'll give us two emeralds. There is and a we're lot of coal in a desert. Here. No, no, no. Don't even mind the coal. What do you want me to get? 15 glass gives us two emeralds. And three emeralds gives us 17 storage discs. That is the trade of a lifetime right there. Because they're annoying to make. Because you have to make like basic circuitry. And then you need to use redstone, iron and gold. So if you can just trade off glass for it pretty much. That's a win. Yeah. That is definitely a win. So let's get try get two stacks of... Uh, let's see. What was it? 15 for two emeralds. So we need six emeralds in total, and we'll get 34 discs. That'll keep us going for ages. That is so good. Yeah, so let's do that. We need, what, 45 glass? Oh, I've already got the sand for that. <laughs> That's crazy. Just need to cook it up now. Uh, How easy oh, they is might that? Uh, yeah, have a look burn. around. See if they have any um, more scientists, because they're the ones who will trade with ah, the uh, with the okay. dino. We have syringes. That's know, good that's as well. Good. That's not bad. I mean, if we, especially because we can trade the glass or coal, forty yeah, three emeralds, emeralds for sixteen storage discs. Yeah, that's that is. Sick. Oh, there's a guy there selling seventeen for three. <laughs> oh, fifteen. Yeah, He's under 15 cutting. Glass, two emeralds. Okay. Yeah, that's what we're gonna go with that trade right there. I'm going. I'm just back up to our area to cook this up. Yeah, cool. I um. Just oh wait, to... the T Rex. The T Rex egg is probably ready. Oh, I totally forgot about that. Yeah, we kind of got straight onto the Dryosaurus. Right, let me, um, should probably make another furnace, actually, to get this speeding up a little bit. Yes, yes, sir. Do we have any emeralds? I don't think so. No, but that's fine. Oh, we've got 36 right. glass already. Huh? Do oh, I have these any... scientists are so cool. I never, I never seen, seen one of these the last, last time around. Oh, really? Yeah, they're Two pretty emeralds. helpful. Two emeralds for a ten petri dish. I don't know if that's a. It's it's it does nah. The petri dishes are easy because you do just have to um, you pretty much just have to make them with glass, so it's yeah. straightforward. Let me that cook up some right food yet. for us to eat now. I can grab some of this glass. So what was it? Fifteen glass. Fifteen glass get was for two emeralds. Is that the way it went? Yeah. So we need forty-five. Okay. So I've got forty-one pieces of glass already. So we just need uh four more. Nice. nice. And I've got the T-Rex egg. So you wait there a second. I'll get these three and TP to you. Yes, I am. And then we'll... More. Then we can come back and sleep it out. And then we're going to put the T-Rex down in with the Spino. Hopefully they grow up to be friends. I mean, it's kind of my bad if they don't. Yeah. I think they will. Do you reckon? I mean, they're babies. They are babies. And babies tend to just kind of get on with each other. They just want to play. Yeah, they just want to play. Yeah, they're going to be running around. It's all going to be good. <laughs> yeah. I, I hope. Hopefully. Right, you there? I'm going to TP yeah. to you. Right, where are these traders? Let's see. They all gone in to sleep, are they? Where you at? Where you at, guys? I want to make some deals. There's a few guys around here. That's coal for emerald. Who wants glass? Which one of you wants glass? Yeah. You want meat? These go, these no. Are Petri That's mine. Brothers. No. What about you? Oh, this guy's guy is trying to get away from me. There's a guy over here. Which no, one is it? One of these. There was a guy over here somewhere. Hey. Lack. Okay, he's Oh, you. he could be. Yeah, it's this guy. Glass okay, guy's I, over here. I can here. see the guy who wants. Who'll give me the, the seventeen discs then. This guy. Right here. What up, Mister? Give me the am glass. Hey, six emeralds. Nice. Okay, so now. My man over here should provide us a nice little trade. Which one is he? He should. He's 12 syringes. There he is. 17 storage discs. Oh, that is so good. We got 34. Sick. <laughs> that is amazing. You know how much hassle that would have been to make that many? Yeah, that is good. I can't believe this village has been here 
You you must have seen it at some stage. No, I think we did go into the village, but we've never really taken advantage of the trades that they have. You don't think about that because th this is the problem. I mean, with this, you kind of lose run, run of yourself and like track of what you're doing because you get excited by something else. Like even there, you said, oh, what about the Tyr Tyrannosaurus egg? Yeah, totally you do. Totally forgot about that. <laughs> you completely get sidetracked. I totally forgot about it. You get sidetracked all the time. Um, Alright, I'm gonna put one of those storage discs in there. So that Dryosaurus can get to work. And uh, we might be able to have a Dryosaurus DNA then. Right, let's sleep. And what we could do is spawn the T-Rex and get ourselves a Dryosaurus. That'll be fun. Yes. So I'm looking forward to seeing a Dryosaurus. Yeah, I think they'll be funny looking little fellas. Yeah, little, I have a little. feeling they're gonna be little snout nose, little no no nums. Because they they're herbivores, they usually are they don't have any kind of big sharp features, do they? No, not, not really. normally, anyway. No, I mean... Okay. Kind of they look like they got really small heads. Really, yeah? Yeah, huh? So hey, heads. Enderman! That's kind of creepy. What you doing in there? All right, Spino's over there, right? Over in the corner. Okay. You see him? Her, and... I suppose. Oh, by the way, the T-Rex is a female, so it's two females. Okay. I like oh, it. Oh, no. Creeper. Stay away. Creeper. I don't have a... a... Hmm... I actually kind of wanted that to explode over there so it doesn't hit the fences. Yeah, I wanted that to happen. <laughs> yeah, I can let that happen. All right, now. Where are you at? Okay. I want to show you this. Oh, I'm here. Sorry. That's one of you. Boom. Kill him. Right, so we made a mess there, but we can fix that. Ah, that's not a big deal. Okay, so two female dinos. Will they be friends? Let us find out. I need to get rid of the, the likes of the crafting bench and stuff in here. Can I ask you a question? You can. Do they, do, will they interact? Like, will, could they fight, like, straight away? Even I'd babies? like to think not. I mean, maybe. But I prefer, I hope they this. don't. I've never seen this before, so I don't know what if this is. The good news is, no is we've got the DNA. So if it does happen, we can just set up a different, a different area for it. But I would yeah. like to think that they'll be friends. That's the goal here. So. <gasps> well, I spawned underground. What? No. How is that even a thing? Take him out. How did you spawn under gray? Oh, I'm, I saved. I saved your life, T-Rex. So I'm like a hero now. Oh, the Spinosaurus is Get a out. lot bigger. Get out. <laughs> okay, they're just chilling. Okay, now you're okay, not going to be happy. Here. Okay. Oh, they're getting close. Hey, look. Eat some of them. They're just kind of feeling each other Eat out. Eat some food. I know they don't I don't. Eat as much when they're young, don't they? No, they tend they to eat a lot when they're older. Hey, be friends. Okay. They're doing their own thing at the minute. Yeah, they're feeling it out a little bit. I mean, it's, it was always a bit kind of dodgy. I mean, this is the Spinosaurus' ground. Like. It's definitely a risk. Okay. Hey, Ooh. they walk right by each other. We okay. good, boys? We good, girls? I'm going to say boys, girls. Uh, this is looking good. So far, so good. good. Yeah, I like this. Let's see if they stay friends. I would like I to think, think they will. If they grow up together, we have a chance. Yes. Right. Okay, that I'm is, getting that out is of here cool. now. Because I don't want to be stuck in when they suddenly decide I'm actually a meal. Ooh, that, and that is going to be very soon. <laughs> yeah, you know how fast these things grow. Um, okay, so we have a Spinosaurus and a T-Rex in the same pan. Very excited. Guys, let us know if you think that is a good idea down in the comments section down below. We Has also... Be Dryosaurus. Dryosaurus is next. So we had 85% DNA and we got 30. So now we can nice. stick these in together. Let's get the combinations going. Yeah, and I think we have everything else we need. So, ooh, we need more. I think we've got three. Yeah, we do. We've only got one more um, peat moss after this. So, we're going to try to get the Dryosaurus. So, what we'll do, Scoob Steve, is quickly let's build ourselves a little pan and stick them in it. Make them look nice. We'll do it over, okay. over that side because that side's not got used yet. We need to make this a full part. So, let's get to work. Okay, guys, we should be ready. We've got the pen. Yeah, we were going to finish it, but we got a little bit lazy. We've started it. We've started it. Enough to probably keep... Oh, I forgot we don't even have the, the egg started. Oh, Oops. okay, yeah. We probably should have got that done. We should have got we it done while we were building. No. Oh, you, know, you know what I'm thinking? The more I think about it, I know I looked it up, but I didn't really see many images of it. But um, if it's only human-sized... Human when size, it's yeah. Grown, 
it's gonna be tiny maybe this uh, pen we just built might be a little bit too big i mean because it'd just be the size of a human baby but here's the thing as well we could have multiple like loads of them in there so that's oh, kind of cool yeah there's that too See, um I'm hmm. back. okay there's a t-rex i came over to take a look and make sure everyone's oh there you two are okay they were actually over with each other the okay. T-Rex and Spino, they're they're good. They're good. It's straight, gonna take it's, it's gonna good. take a lot of uh, keeping an eye on what they're up to. I think, make sure. I think I need to do like a, a pathway up and over, so we can peer down. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Oh, a glass bridge a glass above bridge. the T-Rex pen. <laughs> One. That's yeah, that's an idea. I like I mean, that. You're gonna have to keep an eye on these two. You know, I don't want to bring it up yeah. again. But you have already lost one. I do lost. like. Yeah, it happens. It. It doesn't happen. No, it that does, though. But, like, I mean... <laughs> trust me. Trust me. It happens. I lost, what? Two, three Triceratops? I don't think you even know about that. Oh, well. <laughs> Do you know what happened, right? One of them... Oh, here we, go. we don't know why. It got, like, diseased or something and just kept... Just... Just... Anyway, didn't end well for it. So then I got another one. And yes. on my way out to hatch it, I right-clicked to close the door. And Tiny Turtle closed it just at the same time so i spawned it in the door and it died so we didn't even get it out to the pen <laughs> oh wow that's how bad it was all right that is not good. so dryosaurus egg is finally in the incubator would you like to take a little sleep and then what we'll do is go and place it in the pen and see how beautiful this little dino is we need this pack to be huge so oh yes if this is a small dino we should definitely try get like a pack of them together, like six of them. Yes, that's exactly what I was thinking because oh. it is definitely big Speaking enough. Speaking of which, I accidentally let it continue running. So we do have a second one on the way now. That's <laughs> but good. the only thing is, we do we have the PMOS? I think we've got eggs. one. Yeah, there's we one, do. One PMOS, there's one PMOS in there. We'll yeah, well, that, that one's cooking that one. Would it do another one at the Would same time? Would it do another one at the same time? Okay, let's go fast and see. So oh, all I need to do is look if it like only did yeah like, get it to like way. three quarters or something now uh, maybe 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 it'll happen let's see let's stick it in oh no so wait because didn't we need one pair oh it's one pair. when we okay, remember yeah, when yeah. yours didn't do it because of it we do have one more yeah. here can i put two in i can okay there we go that'll at least do yeah. something now okay, so nice two, two little ones yeah two little ones he's right. gonna be basically brother and sister i mean Gonna be hatched at the same time. If, they, if it's a boy and a girl. I reckon just do random again. Yeah, I like leaving it random. I like leaving it up to fate. I mean, eventually, if we need, we could definitely uh, kind of decide which way to go with it. If, like, let's say you want a female or a male for whatever reason. But for now, it's like, yeah, whatever. Oh, they're both going at the same time now because there's two. Nice. Hey, that's nice. So what I'm doing over here is I'm just cooking up some more glass. I've got some more panes there just to finish off that one area because we just need, I think, the middle strip. And then on the other side, the glass bridge. I really want that as well. So I'll use the panes over there and we'll use the actual glass blocks to, Ooh, to make it. I got some our... glass blocks here. If you, you got so some? You take... yeah, cool. There's only like 30. I'm cooking up another 55. It's so nice living beside a desert. So much I mean, easier. I was just gonna say you have an awesome location here because you got extra height if you want it. Yeah. Um, you got a lot of water supply and you got a little lava supply there too. And you got a village close by. This it, is a really, really good location. Listen, if you didn't think if you don't think yeah. I kinda knew that when I when I chose it. Yeah, I was definitely. like, look, we've got desert there. And also, do you know what was right beside us? Uh yeah. Raptor Pen. Oh, no way. I've never seen yeah, one. Yeah, we found one or two now so far flying oh, around. Dude, that is so cool. I there like the go. way it's kind of in a valley. Like, if you look the opposite side of where your like, little base is, you've got, like, kind of the same going mm -hmm. on. And I see someone start, started, like, building something. Tiny around. Turtle got... wanted yeah, to put his house right. over there. And he wanted his house, like, kind of above everything as usual. So, yeah. King of the Castle. He built stilts. And that's about it so far. Tiny Turtle never finishes something never, he builds. No, never, that? never, never, ever. Never, ever once does he finish. He starts with, and he wants to have this, like, big, grand, huge castle. Want, and yeah, then, the castle. <laughs> and then he, the he won't even put a door on it. Look at it. <laughs> All right. So this first egg is done. Oh, I'm after I mean, leaving that other one to female. Okay, I can change that. 
So we're gonna make these brother and sister because I accidentally left that one okay. flat on yeah, females. Cool. Cool. We've got a female, so let's get this male and then let's hatch them over in their new pen. I love it. Do you know what we need to do? Do you know those signs in Jurassic Park where it like it gives you the info on the dinos and stuff like that? We need to get them up yeah. around the place. Say um like Dryosaurus and then get a size and like a scale. Like yeah. have a human standing there in like a scale. That'd be sick and then be like cool, herbivore. All that sort of stuff. Take a look. Out. Take a look at it and see how T-Rex and yeah. Spino are getting on. Oh, you need names also. So the guys I in the know. comments. Yeah. People, people have been leaving names for the Spinosaurus. But now that there's the T-Rex and Spino guys. And if you want to do like a... Well, I suppose they're both female, aren't they? So you could do two girl names. And we can choose from those. Spinarella. Um, Dryosaurus. <laughs> will we even put names on them? I mean, I feel like we're going to have a lot of them. Um, yeah... Not now. Not now. Not now, anyway. I've got the two eggs. If you want to come over, we'll have a look and yeah. see how these guys get on. Let me actually grab the rest of those panes, and we can finish out that middle as well. We need to finish off the back, and we need to put a roof on it, but we can do that another time. Yeah, they're gonna. these guys, I have a feeling that they're going to be really small. Yeah. Like, I'm wondering, could they climb up over these panes, though? I need. We probably need to close it off just in case. Could they? No, I mean, um, yeah, because if they're tiny, they might be able to fit out one block. That's the problem. Be able to. Yes, good thinking. Mm. I don't have any pain. I, I've got some, man. I've got some more blocks as well if we really need. So let me throw these around. Boom, boom. So this would be nice. This would be like a proper little enclosure. And if you guys think we should make it bigger, let us know in the comments if you know anything about these dinos. I know they need grass to eat, but I think... I think any herbivores like that, Scuba Steve, if they're like on plain area, they'll eat seeds in the grass, so you don't actually need to feed them. Okay, well that's good because I I know obviously you got the feeder, the automatic feeder thing. Uh huh. And um, for the bigger um, meat eating uh, dinosaurs, but yeah, I never really thought about for the herbivores really. I think they do. I think they do. Now correct me if I'm wrong, guys, in the comments, but that seems to be with the way the Triceratops worked but i think some of them need water so i don't know if these guys will need water so here we go i'm gonna give you the female oh egg time i've got mm -hmm. the male let's hatch these new dinos ready okay. three two one go oh it's tiny yes. <laughs> I knew be so oh they're cute though oh look oh, these, these are our dragons wander dragons dinos wander follow sit oh they'll actually listen to us Ooh. oh that is so we well, need cool. to get dinos that we can uh ride around on by the way Imagine that. Oh, oh wait, he can, yeah. they can get out here. Right, we need to make sure there's no areas they can they, do that. If they're gonna grow up to be human sized. Oh, let me out. Yeah, jump up there and then we'll block it. Um, Yeah, I mean, if these are gonna be human sized, maybe I'm thinking, or maybe, I think they might be a little bit bigger than humans. Oh, it'd be so cool if we could like stick a saddle on them or something. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm just putting these here for now. They don't look great, but at least it means they cannot get out anywhere. Oh, so goodness. Look at them. They're tiny. Let's go out and have a look at the enclosure. See what it looks like. Yeah. Oh, they sound so funny as well. <laughs> they sound like chickens. Okay, where are they? Oh, you can't even see them. Oh, there they are. Over there. Hey, little dinos. Welcome to... I nearly said Jurassic Park. That would have been good, wouldn't it? <laughs> like in the movie. Um, yeah, so we don't actually have a name for our dinosaur park. Let's, I suppose it's Dino Park for now. We might Let's decide on something. Team. Scuba Steve Land. Yes. That's a good one as well. Mm. All right. Yeah, but guys, I think that is it for today's episode. We have a T-Rex and a Spinosaurus that are going to grow up together. Let us know if you think it's a good idea. Two Dryosaurus. We will probably get a big bunch of those. You know that, Scuba Steve? I'm thinking we should yeah. get at least six in that pen. They can be a little family. But um, other than that, we've done well. We are working towards the Brachiosaurus and uh, a lot more dinos as well guys thank you so much for watching subscribe if you're new turn on the notifications by hitting the bell and leave a big thumbs up and we will see you soon for more bye guys bye